Hey guys, me Tom and I'll show you another war replay. And we've probably seen this base like a million times before. There's really common base. But after the update, this is actually really bad. So five, five zaps on between this area at this tile because you can t t reach two scatter shots and a CC and then two to take out a sweeper and then the earthquake takes you know unfortunately the town hall gets activated but what can you do at least the two scatter shots and a CC are down now as everyone knows, these kind of teaser bases, they're extreme with traps on one side. So, better to be safe than sorry. Didn't re- well, you could use headhunters if you wanted to, but you'd probably better not, not to because, like I said, Town Hall does splash damage, kind of, onto five targets, so... Yeah, the headhunts just won't last long, even if the enemy here is on the outside. So now, we took out four of the four important buildings and a sweeper. We may as well try to take out this sweeper. And we may as well try to take out one of the air defences to help the path in. Either this one or this one, but if we go for this one, we get a sweeper as well. So let's try for this one. Let's see how the, how the queen does. <laughs> nice. Unfortunate that the RC is kind of getting held up a bit, but what can you do? Nice. Nice RC shield bounce. <laughs> okay, so now we've got like a big hole from here. Two, two sweepers, two scatter shots, one CC, one town hall, and pretty much most of the Teslas are down in already. So we've got two air defenses here, a bunch of buildings in the corner in the middle. And then one air defense there, and then all this backside. So, what can you do, really? Well, let's just pretend the lava loom wasn't there. If it came from this side, then the hounds would initially be here, and then they would fly, they would split off, split off to this direction, and also this direction, so no good if you start from here if you start from the top then like i said nothing will tank for them so no good there if you start from this side this top top left side then the hounds will go there and this lanes will split up there so that's no good either the ideal way is probably to start from bottom left so the lanes will probably group up towards the top left where the hound will be tanking defenses so yeah let's try that and then the slam coming in from the back end because slam it doesn't uh, doesn't go directly for air defenses, so they could tank the wizard towers on the backside. So but yeah, the good nice puffing is made at the moment. Nice, nice reward in the I guess. And then slammer here on top. I think the slammer was a bit little late, but I don't know. I guess it could tank that uh, wizard tower. And now, yeah, that's good because. Multi Inferno and Wizard Tower uh, are big threats to your loon, lava loon. Um,
Nice. So now, that was good. Now it's up to clean up. And we're lucky that we got a few pups from the exploded lava house. The reason why this was a free start with this zap plow up. Number one, zap value. <clears throat> it took out one sweeper, two scat shots, and CC. That's huge value. Then, with this teaser base, you send in two ice golems at the bottom. Suicide heroes takes out uh, RC, King, Queen, Town Hall, and like a Tesla fan. And with the RC, you can push in and take out an air defense, and take out the second sweeper and make pathing for your initial Lalo entry point. <clears throat> and then did the Lalo clockwise, yeah, clockwise, rotational, and then with the slammer on the back end, <clears throat> on one of the back end where there's no air defenses, but a lot of splash damage, uh, AKA the free wizard towers. But yeah, <clears throat> that's, that's why the three stars. Value and puffing. Value and puffing, remember those. And yeah, this is a, this is a common base, so common base number 45, so if you watch this video and remember it, then you know what to do. But anyway, thanks for watching guys, and peace out.